I think my goal is uh, to leave this school after a workshop and to at least get to a point where everybody can say, okay, I made an experience with this work that I can, can use for other cases. And it's like a little suitcase with little tools and little um, tricks I can use for the rest of my life. But these tools are just my very personal tools. Nobody else might use them but me. I think one of the main things that our teacher Nico emphasizes is that it's all about research and exploration. So instead of being like, oh, I can only do it this way, it's like, ah, actually it's like this. You know, so I think that is something I've gained from the workshop is that the limitations only exist in in how we perceive something, but there's always a different approach. And if I'm feeling maybe stuck in myself emotionally in terms of how to connect to a physical gesture or how to connect to a colleague, then it's maybe about trying something new. It's not there's actually a problem there. So that is so valuable. No matter what performance I'm doing, I can use that. It doesn't make so much sense to me to um, to transform the music itself because then they started also from the very musical way and they create things and this is not the idea to create and to design new ideas to show how free we are. It's more what happens if I just breathe and from breathing I hum a bit the melody and from humming I start to laugh a bit and from laughing I get into singing and and I stop all of a sudden and then I shout it out all of a sudden. So um, it's more to find a connection to the music in a very personal way before I go back to sing it technically. And when you have found this connection, you can also sing in a very high technical quality, but there will be a little personality in between, which makes it interesting. There was no intention. It was the intention was most about or more about researching, like what are the borders, where can I get with my body, how can I play with the instrument, how can I like incorporate the instrument, how can I maybe play with the instrument as a person or as a, as a scenic body as well, like instrument as a yeah, something being on the stage, not only as an instrument but also yeah, as a kind of body. He tried to move around and I gave him just atmospheres and pictures and he played with them. And he did it really very intensive and very careful and in a way a whole composition happened and it also had a very nice dramaturgy and it was a bit like a love story between a piano and himself and um, yeah, with all the pain in between that a biography can have when you work hard on music and composition. I liked it a lot too.